top eight. All right, Jack, no more fucking around. No more messing around. No more fucking around. We were allowed to swear a few times on this podcast. That's one of our two. <laughs> We've already used it up. I used the second one just then, and it's okay. <laughs> we have Davox22, SA Local, versus McLeod, SA Local, both of them. Yeah, this is huge. Uh, They're giving us a thumbs up, and but it's one second until we start. All right, so this will be a fun match. I think... Um, I think it was Flowey was telling me that these guys haven't really played this much this year because they keep going to tournaments like that the other isn't going to. They keep through. dodging each other, dude. I think they've played two times this year mm. because in the past six months, yeah, like Davox will go to one tournament, then McLeod will go, not go to that one, and vice versa. And it's just been week in, week out. I believe off the top of my head, Davox has the better of it uh, in tournaments, but uh, they've been playing a lot on netplay lately, and uh, McLeod's hard, according to Davox. He's saying he's gotten a lot better, yep. just can't beat him. Can't beat him on netplay, but um, we'll see. Tournament Davox, as we know, a whole different beast. It's true. Sunday Davox is a notorious uh, animal on the... I was going to say the queues, but we're not on netplay. Um, at, at tournaments. On He's the setup. On the setup, that's the one. But we'll see what happens here. This is um, this is the pride of South Australia right here. SA Nick sitting pretty in winners. Are these the only other two left? Oh, Muscat's also in losers. Muscat's also in losers, so we have a great amount of top eight action coming. It looks like they're playing on Dreamland, which I think is an... Would you go to Dreamland as Sheik? Yeah, you ban FD, and probably it's like, it's the classic Fox scenario where, like, you got to pick between Dreamland and Pod for the startup. Yeah. Um, I guess, yeah, yeah. So it's pretty much the same thing. Dreamland's fine. <laughs> They got right. this. Here we go. There we go. Yeah. They are now getting into it on Dreamland. Clyde's about to type up a storm on DevOps. Yeah. <laughs> I love saying that, like, box players are typing. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. Like, it's like, just type the finisher here. T type in the end. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Ooh. Slow start. Oh, yeah. but big down smash. Oh. Hey, look, that's 15 seconds in, and it's looking like this first stock is, might be wrapped up. If you can finish it. Oh, DevOps gets out. And... This should be dead, right? Oh my God, clean. Yeah. So, McLeod, uh, famous innovator of the pen dash, right? And uh, I saw one earlier today, and apparently against SA Nick, he was also he was hitting them. Yeah, uh, I well, when I played him in bracket, he was hitting them against me, and so all I started to do was run away because I didn't know what to do. Get me out of here. It was scary seeing a yeah. Peach get on and be vulnerable, even for a few frames, because that's supposed to be a weird that, that ain't right. You know, that ain't that right. Goes, it's, against against nature. <laughs> it's unnatural. Yeah. Yeah, it's unnatural to see this Peach um, do this. So between uh, Phantom and now, it appears that McLeod has put in a lot of work into getting that tournament ready mm. and a bit more consistent. He, he didn't really go for them before, but uh, now it seems to be a big part of his play, so watch out for that. Viewers. Oh my god, the needs. Oh, he misses it. Oh, Come on, Davin, you have to hit these edge guards if you want to win this set. Mm. But if Davin can get this stock relatively quickly, it should like be okay. But if he gets over 100%, then like he's just going to die to an air. Yeah, it's it's tough to make comebacks as either of these characters, I feel. Yeah, well, both of them are like characters that more wear you down slowly over the course of a stock and then finish it off. Compared yeah. to something like a Fox Falco Falcon Marp, that like you can just die at 20%. Yeah, like, like, like they'll just kill you. How the game is going for like the first two minutes is how the game is going to go for the next two minutes most of the time. Yeah, 100%. Um, so Davin's down a stock, but let's see if he can just try to, I guess, pull some. Oh, oh, the needles messed up his timing. Yeah, that's crazy. Because yeah, to make a comeback, you got to outplay Peach like four different times. And then even then, she, on Dreamland, you might hit her away at like 90% and it's still just not going to be enough. Yeah, like neutral wind netted him after the fair. Yeah. Back air. Oh, what do you do? It's 90%. Back air. It's like, how many more times does he have to win neutral before yeah. he like, you know? Oh, oh. nice. It's still not going to kill Dreamland. It's Dreamland, of course it's not. Ooh, okay. okay. Oh, wait, back air. Got more Co options oh. here. I was oh. expecting him to do a wow. double jump back air, but that was Should be an up air. Up air. Man. <laughs> okay, oh, there it is. Yeah. Nice. Okay. Look, even stocks now. Davin's brought that back after he kind of got washed that first stop. Ooh. Love a shield there. <laughs> oh, look out. Down tilt. Down tilt. Wow. So smart. Pushing him off with the, the narrow shield. And I don't know about that from Davin. He got baited. Yeah. And like 93 or whatever it was. It's so early to lose a stock against Peach. Exactly. It's... Now he's down the full stop, and he has to deal with the trading monster brick wall that is Peach. Yeah, like they're already almost even for Sans. Yeah. Oh, nice. Oh, kind of flub. Okay. I heard a jump, I believe. Oh, wow. I heard a jump. Oh, 
Nice. Whoa. So good, actually. Great coverage. I can't believe that hit. I wouldn't have done that. Yeah, I thought he would have got a parasol for sure. Yeah, there's definitely times where, like, I'll be watching Davin play, and I'm like, I would expect him to do a... Okay, he's got a lead now. This is the first lead this set. And by this set, I mean this game. That wave dash back was insane. Yeah, Davin gets access to so many more options by nature of just being clean with it. Yeah, 100%. <laughs> by being goaded. Or even percent, all the space. Oh my oh. god, the double poof. It's so close. The shield grabs him. The fair. Oh, fair Come again on. on the 20 winner. Okay, this okay, could be... Is he going to jump in? Oh, the fair. damn. Big win by Davox in that game one. He was behind the whole time and then just turned it up and it looked like McLeod couldn't get a sniff. I can't believe it. Look at this guy. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Hey, the double cam. Hey, what about this? Dude, no way. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so to FD, this is a pretty natural counter pick. Um, Sheik has less needle angles. Um, I actually don't know many of the other reasons. All I know is that I hate FD and I couldn't play it. So. Yeah, Sheik on a platform is just notorious, know. uh, notoriously hard to get it on. Um, because she can cover the diagonal space so well with needles and like her platform game with aerials is just so strong. It's like Plop made a career out of being quick on the platforms with and, Sheik. And then you just take that all away with FD. You have yeah. your big flat pizzeria tray. <laughs> That's and, all you got. Yeah. Um, it just, it's better for, for neutral, for Peach. And uh, you probably get a couple more uninterrupted combos to be honest. But uh, yeah, we'll see true. how we go. And being a bigger stage as well, you can kind of, um, you know, have more space to get, like, turnips and stuff, like that. Ooh, Ooh the needles. Yeah. Needle, the needle hit stun is always surprising, man. Like, I, no matter what, because the amount of needles changes the amount of hit stun, yeah. even, though, even though it's, like, slightly, and it's enough to, like, mess with specific timing, especially with, like, every character in Melee, where you're, um, like, going for pretty frame tight inputs. Yeah, it's like hitting an Ice Climber's shield when there's anywhere between one and four nanas yeah. in the mix, <laughs> and you just don't know until you hit it. That's just, uh, you keep hitting that button and you hope that it comes out. Yeah. Ooh, I'm liking these double up airs, and he gets to jump again, I believe. Oh. Wow! Wow! I thought, Whoa. I will say, I thought he beefed it when he, didn't, when he didn't do the quick wave dash back to the ledge, but he managed to get around the parasol. Insane space. Like I said, he gets more choices. He's playing out of his mind! He's dead! Wow! Oh my god, he's been killed to death. Okay. One for the road. Okay, he doesn't need that. Ooh, 20% easy. 31. Ooh. Okay, that's fine. Oh, nice. That that, was, that's the skip SSPM, actually. That was clean. Oh, he goes for it. Okay, for those of you that don't know what that is. Oh my god, he's getting nice. kooky with it. Okay, so with Peach Up Smash, there's a specific part of like Sheik's get up. Uh, and I think Marth, they're like get up from like up e recovery animations where you can like hit them with like the sweet spot of like Peach Up Smash because normally it only ever like sour spots from standing or whatever. But if you do it at a certain spacing, at a certain timing, you can get the sweet spot, kill it like 90%. So McLeod went for it right there. You got to turn around and hit him at the back of it. And uh, didn't pan out. And uh, now we're at 2 0. Dab it. Yeah, I was expecting this to be way closer. Like, I did not expect that FD game to go as it yeah. did. Davin was just catching Cloud's um, recoveries to ledge with the really, really low fares, and it was just it was just destroying the cloud. Davin's playing like the Davin I think of in my head when I think of Davin, you know, the way he's like, just hitting everything, you know? Yeah. It's like, this is the Davin that like actually uh, people are worried about. Like when you run into them in bracket and you're like versing this guy who's just crazy on stage. Yeah. But then, like, you play him in friendlies, and he just like messes uh -huh. around. Yeah. But in friendlies, Davin is notorious for a little bit of a little bit of messing around. Oh, a little bit of messing around. Oh wow! Get the air dodge out of that. I will say though, he has to watch out for hubris. He, uh, despite his cool, calm, and collected nature, Davin is prone to a little bit of hubris here and there. If he gets a lead, sometimes he uh, he gets a bit ahead of himself. Uh, last stock against Rizal in the uh, in the earlier set. He went for like a crazy like needle into like wall jump fair that just missed and he has deed. Yeah. And like went down to the last stock. And he comes up to me afterwards, he's like, I went for a devil devil combo, because that's what we call like crazy needle edge cards. <laughs> devil combo. Yeah, he's like, I went for a devil combo. I'm like, it wasn't even close. He's like, I would imagine though. And I'm like, oh Davin. I like that. I like imagine. 
Yeah, he's a, he's a dreamer. Oh yeah. my god, these jabs back and forth. Two, two. Davin's up. Two. What's McLeod gonna do here, to be honest? How do you beat this beast? Yeah. Davin's just getting so many grabs. I think that ball. Can you push up? <laughs> so people cheering in the background. Oh, it doesn't make it back. So yep. close. He just don't like this uh, this matchup, and uh, sometimes it's easy to forget why. But Devin is show he's showing us why it kind of kind of blows. You know, it's like I guess if you're just because like oh my god, <laughs> what happened? He, he was stopping a storm. <laughs> um, you know the I guess the issue with the matchup was well, not the issue with it. It's just like if you get grabbed as like Peach. Um, Sheik just has so much guaranteed stuff out of it, like just especially kill confirms at a higher percent. And you have the limb, limbs to space out like away from there, there, and things like that. And then oh, you also, oh I told you, devil combo, I told you he's got to watch out for hubris, man. <laughs> Who's hubris? <laughs> oh, he got some needles? And is he dead? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He should have just gone to ledge. That, one of Davin's vices, I would say. One of the few critiques I can uh, offer Davin is that he ints too often by arms attacking way earlier than he should. Like, he should have just yeah. eaten the aerial there because, like, often he arms attacks and it's easily covered by, like, a fox up smash or something else. Yeah. And he just eats more damage or just, like, dies when he shouldn't. Oh, oh God, he grabs grabbed him the out of smash. Oh, what, what was that? He went for okay. He's He's down, down smash. smash. Yep. We are the same. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> I should be in top eight. <laughs> oh. Yeah, he's dead. No, Surely? No. Oh. He just One last chance. Turn up. He's going to try to tech here. No, this time he just eats it. He's not just on this time. Up oh my god. Oh, yeah, okay. McLeod getting himself on the board. 2-1. Devin, uh, Devin gets to go battlefield here. He has to go uh, battlefield. We'll see if he does get he's, that. He's going to be feeling real good, I think. I imagine he picks up. I can't actually hear what he wanted there. Okay, quick needle, oh, get three. I so much on my... Don't look at me. Oh, no. Um, Skip SSPM does not know how to drink. Drink out of a cup. Hey, you spilt it earlier, man. <laughs> hey, he, he smelt it, Delta. Okay, so. We'll see this stage a bit more favorable for Sheik. You have uh, your set platform heights. You have really good diagonal um, needle angles and all that other good stuff. Oh, don't like Crazy. that, though. Oh, that, I do like this. Yeah, something about Battlefield is just feels real nice as a sheep. You know? Everything yeah. is just like where it should be, you know? It, it's just, I think it's just good more because you're the sheep player, but like you have all your options just readily available. It feels yeah. like your your best just, oh! Nice. <laughs> Needles are around back here. Oh, no, no. You, just <laughs> you missed his Z-Stick. <laughs> it's right there. It's the big oh. yellow one. Okay, good dodge. Oh, he's going to chase him down. There's some bats in the venue, apparently, from the squeaking that I just heard. It's like his basketball shoes. <laughs> yeah, basketball shoes. <laughs> he's going crazy. Oh, wow. He's really quick on his needle turnarounds at the moment. Davin is just... Look at his movement. <laughs> but I, I have a feeling he's going to do all this movement. He's going to hit by an air and die. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, nice. Okay, it was so worth it. Caught that jump. Uh, caught that jump. Caught that jump. Okay. He's going to look for a grab here and hopefully not miss his... Uh, Wave lands. Oh, 2%. Oh, he hit the needles. Devin's doing his best Chris Angel mind freak impression right now. What does it even mean? He's just trying to trick McLeod into thinking that uh, he's going to be places that he isn't. Chris Angel's, oh. Chris Angel's never tricked me in my life. He's a pure <laughs> magician. <laughs> Everything he does is real. It's all real. How else did he go to the top of that pyramid in Las Vegas? That's actually new now that I think about it. Yeah, come on now. I'm gonna have to watch that back. <laughs> I can only check the box. Oh! Okay. Okay. Oh, get the jump. Needle. Grab it. Okay. Good back in. Now he's got to catch the land. Options. Got options. Oh, he has a brand new whip and he's hopping in. Okay. He's just, he's doing really smart, like just not jumping into the peach that's sitting there and floating waiting. Yeah. He's oh, watch out, watch out. <sighs> Did he just, he jumped up to go for a needle and then cancelled it and just fared out of that air? That was crazy. Yeah, so what sick. what happened earlier was um, I'm pretty sure McLeod did a up B refresh to try and get a pedge dash, but Davin put needles there and McLeod hit them and it fucked the timing up oh. real bad. He just did like a regular get up instead. Oh, this match is awful for Peach. <laughs> I think a big thing as well is that Sheik's shield is so big. Oh, like, yeah. you do not get clipped by Down Smash as badly as some other characters in the cars. Yeah, you can tank, like, the first two hits of Down Smash and kind of wave that shot and get it. And then you play Marth and you barely tank the first. <laughs> yeah. 
Oh my god. Oh, you get... <gasps> nice. oh dude, he's, <laughs> yeah. he's in the uh, the moth. Uh, what's it called? The gallant thing. Yeah. <laughs> bonk dash. <laughs> yeah, he's doing bonk dashes and shit. Savin is, uh, I think he might have tried it there, but he's also not interacting with turnips when he's off stage. You can, like, nair them and then, like, use them as, like, a tricky recovery. Yeah, because you can up into them and stuff. Yeah, but uh, he's simply choosing to avoid them, usually by burning his double jump early. Which, uh, okay. you know. Oh, it gets clipped. It's so hard not to. No matter how good you are, I feel like there's always a chance. Okay, Dam is just choosing not to interact with the, the Peach floating in the goddamn abyss of the stage up the top. He's doing so... Look at his platform movement. It's just so clean. He has way... Nice! Ooh, I'm not biased. He has way more to lose by, like, interacting with Peach in her zone. Yeah, I feel like that's the case with a lot of trading characters. So stuff like Peach, Luigi. There's characters that, like... Oh, f Oh, my God. Okay. Okay, let's see if he can his hold. Maybe a mistake in that uh, up here. But, yeah, like... Uh, learning as a player to not interact with like the Peach or the Luigi that's just only slowly towards you because you're probably just gonna get clipped and you're probably just gonna take more of like your risk reward's not there. Yeah. Like there was a fine trade to take. Yeah. Trades are fine for Davin here. Especially at this percent. Um, yeah. Like the, the stock thing, the stock count. Bro. They'll both get sent far enough that like it's pretty much over. Oh. He's doing it. Uh, we're gonna get around the, uh, the little lip. Whoa. Oh. And there we go. <laughs> okay, this is one hit. Oh. oh, it doesn't kill. It's soft. It's weak. It's, it's soft. Oh, see, that's what I'm talking about. I can't believe you would not the, sh the shield that held up, the shield that held strong. And any, Davin takes a 3-1, oh literally, my god. Literally any other character is getting clipped by that down smash and getting obliterated, shredded. That's insane. Davin. Blended. Oh my god. Well, there you go. What Three a character. Chic. That's the best. I think that makes him, uh, based on what Floyd was saying, he may be uh, number one PR when they release yeah. one in SA. Who knows? Oh wow. Congratulations, Davin.